Today we're out at Lake Hancock at the Southwest Florida Water Management District treatment cells. And what the cells do is they filter water. And my name is Al Carlin. I work in mapping and GIS at the Water Management District. I'm a senior spatial scientist. Twice a year, we monitor the success of the cells. To do that assessment, we use an aerial survey. We look to see whether any damage has been done due to hurricanes, and we look to determine whether the plants are growing as they should be. We've been working with Janie now for about the past five years. I'm Janie Hagberg, Chief Professional Engineer in the SWIM program. SWIM is the Surface Water Improvement and Management Program. I've been working on the Lake Hancock project since 2004. And the work that Al Carlin has been doing for us is to obtain the best imagery possible so that we can look in the interior portion of the wetland and see what's going on. So here in this image, you see emergent vegetation in this region and this darker signature is submerged aquatic vegetation. And what we want to see is the emergent vegetation come in and recruit throughout the cell. And the imagery allows us to track these trends and see what's going on and understand uh, the growth of the vegetation in the cells. Today we're getting a pixel size under an inch, about two centimeters. So we'll be able to tell leaves on plants. The success of the project is dependent on the vegetation growth and coverage in the system. So being able to see the interior portion of the project and the health of the wetland vegetation is critical. Working at the district, I'm constantly amazed by our staff and what their capabilities and expertise is. Waypoint 24. Dr. Carlin is foremost um, in the area of aerial imagery data acquisition. It's a much more efficient technology. It's gonna cost us less money and we get a product much more rapidly. We also have the Water Quality Monitoring Group doing monitoring in the wetlands. And they are also innovative in the ways in which they collect data. And it's a very, very important component of the project. I'm very proud and it makes me very confident about our work when I have folks um, like that working with us. You really can tell that the people take this work to heart and they are doing the best job and, and they're innovators and very good at what they do.